two steel rods and an aluminium rod of equal length L0 uh, of equal cross section area that are joined rigidly at their ends as shown in figure below. Now, all the rods are in state of zero tension at zero degree. Find the length of system when the temperature is raised to theta. Coefficient of linear expansion of aluminium steel are given and young modulus of aluminium steel are also given. All right. Now, first of all, I had to calculate the final length of the system when the temperature is raised to theta. So, let the final length of the system be L theta and the initial length is given as L naught. Fine. So, what I'll write is that total strain of the system is equal to total stress developed in the system to that of total young modulus of the system all right now the total strain it can be written as l theta minus l naught to that of l naught okay now total stress fine now first of all i'll calculate total stress now total stress will be equal to stress let's say stress is denoted by sigma so sigma of aluminium plus two times of sigma of steel because there are two steel rods one aluminium rod and total young modulus so again it will be equal to young modulus of aluminium plus two times young modulus of steel fine now sigma of aluminium can be written as uh, what I write is as strain that is let's say change in length that is equal to L theta minus L naught by L naught into what I say is gamma of aluminium any problem fine now this is nothing but the longitudinal strain and we know that if uh, by thermal expansion the change in length is given by initial length into alpha delta t fine so longitudinal strain is given by alpha delta t so I substitute this over here so I get sigma for aluminium as alpha of aluminium into delta t into y of aluminium similarly for steel I have sigma for I'm sorry alpha for steel into alpha delta t into young modulus of steel substitute both of this over here I have L theta minus L naught by L naught as delta t is taken as common so it comes out to be alpha of aluminium into y of aluminium plus alpha of steel plus y of steel with the two times delta t divided by y of aluminium plus two times of y of steel so on solving this i get the value of l theta as l naught one plus alpha aluminium y aluminium plus two times alpha steel y steel divided by y aluminium plus two y steel into delta t this is my final length of system that is the answer